this question regard to uh, zakat and jewelry. Uh, the jewelry that is uh, used, uh, there is a debate between the scholars when it comes to the jewelry, which is gold or silver. As for gems or precious stones, like diamonds and things from this nature, the ulama uh, uh, kind of agreed that there is no zakat on them. The zakat only on the gold and the silver. And when it comes to the gold, we talk about the pure gold, which is 24 carats. Uh, so if it's 18 carats or it is 21 carats, you have to do a certain formula to figure out how to give the zakat on it. In a simple way, it is the number of carats divided by 24 time price of gram time the gram of gold. Um, and you will be able to figure out what is the zakat uh, in the 18 carats or the 21. Uh, the silver are usually uh, pure. Uh, and also there is something it's called white gold. The white gold, it could be platinum. And if it's platinum, there is no zakat on it. But if it is an actual gold, but plated or painted uh, uh, with colors or mixed with other elements, you have to figure out what is the actual pure gold in it. And that will be, there will be zakat on it. Uh, here, go back to the issue of the jewelry, that uh, the gold or silver that you wear and you use. Even if you don't wear it in a common yeah, any way, or maybe occasionally you use it, like something that you got during uh, in, in your wedding, and you don't use it usually in your daily uh, going out, uh, or you rarely that ever use it. Do I still consider a, a jury that I use? Yes. Uh, in this issue, there is a debate. You will have the Hanafi scholars who believe that there is a, a, a zakat on the jewelry that you uh, use uh, versus the Maliki, the Shafi'i, the Hanbali, who don't believe that there is zakat on the jewelry that they use. And I believe that this is the strongest opinion for me, uh, that there is no zakat on it. But also at the same time, I lean towards a third opinion, which is the choice of Sheikh Islam ibn Taymiyyah rahimahullah ta'ala, and uh, one narration from Imam Ahmed rahimahullah, that there is a zakat on the jury that you use, but one in your lifetime, any amount of money that you give. And it, to be honest with you, this opinion is, a, is an opinion that combined between all evidence. Because those who said you have to give zakat on it, they said the hadith and the verses that speaking about those who possess gold and they don't give the zakat from it, they will be hold accountable on the Day of Judgment will be punished uh, for holding it in without giving any sadaqa uh, 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 on its behalf. So this, they are very general. There's no exception to the jury that you use or not use. Also, there's some of the ahadith uh, that the Prophet ﷺ saw so a woman uh, who wearing masakatani uh, ghalidatan, uh, wearing uh, two bracelets uh, from gold, and he asked if you give Allah's rights over this gold, and mainly that were referred to the zakat. She said, no. Uh, Aisha once was wearing a ring, and he said, do you give the Allah's rights over this gold? She said, no. He said, would you like Allah replace it with rings made of fire? And she took it off. Uh, all these ahadith, it, to be honest, it doesn't really help and support the idea that it means there is zakat in the jewelry that you use because the bracelet or the ring, it, the weight of it will not be 85 grams. And also, put, I said, I just got this ring. So you didn't possess it even for a whole year. So that means the Prophet ﷺ was not talking about the zakat that is regulated the way we are familiar with. And that led Sheikh al-Islam rahimahullah to come to a conclusion that any gold or silver you possess and you have, you should give something on its behalf once in your lifetime, any amount. And I really think that this is a very good opinion and kind of middle opinion to combine between evidence. So if you have any jewelry that you possess, one time in your life, at least you have to give zakat. And if you don't, inshallah ta'ala, uh, uh, there is no harm on it. But if the jewelry that you have, you use it as... Uh, 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 in your portfolio, uh, like a saving that you want, like the saving account that you have dollars or, or, or sterlinis, whatever uh, uh, currency that you save, but you use the gold and stood, there is zakat on it. Because here is not anymore something that you use or uh, you, you wear. And Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala knows best. May Allah accept from all of us. Sallallahu alayhi wa sallam.